Hey, what's up YouTube, it's Zeke, and Robinhood is not out of the fight yet. It's just strikes back with its new update as my account just written above $12,000. Let's get into the video. All right, YouTube, we're back. Welcome to the Dream Green Show. If you haven't already, hit the subscribe button and the thumbs up button. It really helps out this channel a lot. Before I tell you what the new update was for Robinhood, let's go over my account because I just went over $12,000. And as you can tell, I'm very excited because not too long ago, I just had $10,000 in my account and I'm already at $12,000. So if we look at it, uh, the last week I'm up 0.51%, that's $60.41. Of the last month, I'm up $493, that's 4.29% in the last month alone. The last three months has been very, very, very great to me, treating me very well. I am a dividend investor and I do buy growth stocks here and there. I'm up 7.84% uh, with the gain of $873.10. And over the year, I'm beating the market. I'm up 11.79%, um, $1,265.84. And for all time, I'm up $1,700, uh, around 16.89%. So um, it's not too bad. It's actually pretty good for me as a new investor, um, up 16.89% all time is money that I didn't have and my money is actually making money for me. Okay, so I'm gonna show you the quick update right quick before I show you what stocks I actually buy and hold and which stocks I actually uh, reinvest to every single month for dividends. I'm gonna go over the new update that Robinhood just uh, updated on their platform to kind of fight back over all these new app um, investing apps that are now coming into the app stores trying to uh, steal robin hood user base all right so if you click on your profile and go into free stocks so they now have invite three friends and get a fourth bonus stock so you not only would you get a stock for each friend that you invite but for every three that you invite you would get an extra four so there so their incentives are for you to invite your friends to come join and not only would you get a free stock for every person that join, but for every third person that joins, you get an extra stock. So you guys can really stock, uh, stack up on these free stocks and it expires January 1st, 2020, okay? So you guys can get into it now. But not only for that, they're actually looking out for YouTubers that, um, that support Robinhood because if you click on the uh, information button, and scroll down there go over it get more with less you already get a free stock for every friend you refer but now you'll get an extra bonus stock on your third referral all right out of these free stocks you have a one in 250 chance of getting a uh, breaking share halfway apple facebook uh for your fourth stock bonus as well but here's the kicker right here on the last point invite as many friends as you want and receive up to five hundred dollars in free stocks per year if you didn't catch it on it says per year at first youtubers will only get five hundred dollars worth of free stock for the on Robinhood just for inviting all of their friends no matter if they invited a thousand friends last year and a thousand friends this year you can only get five hundred dollars worth of free stock but now they're saying per year so now every single youtuber that uh or anybody that, that promotes Robinhood can now get $500 this year, get $500 next year, and $500 the year following after that. So this is a very big information uh, that Robinhood implemented into their application. And I think it's very good for the um, app itself because the more users they have, the more money they make, and they'll be able to have more and better updates for the app in the future. So um, be on the lookout for a lot of YouTubers actually posting more uh, Robinhood videos now trying to collect their $500 worth of free stock. But um, if you do use my link, the link is down in the description, I will get a free stock and you get a free stock. Just comment down on what free stock did you receive from me. And then invite a couple of your friends out so you could get that for free stock. All right, so what you guys been waiting for, let's go over my account on how do I have $12,000 in my account. 
Well, right now my buying power is $202.49. When the stock market opens tomorrow, uh, if I see some good deals, I'm probably gonna buy some uh, good dividend stocks with my $200, just reinvesting back into my dividend stocks every single month. It's actually helping me grow my account very, very fast. All right, so the first one that I own is AMD. AMD has been killing it for me. I am up 117%. All right, in AMD of $876. Uh, the last month alone from AMD has put this company up 24%. So AMD has had a fantastic year of going up 89% in one year. I keep telling you guys, AMD is my favorite company right now. They have been killing it. It's a little bit overvalued. So once I see a pullback a little bit, I will buy some more AMD stock, but yes, the last year alone, AMD is up 89%. That's because of, they have been crushing their competition with Intel, with their new processors, crushing their competition with Nvidia, with their graphics cards. So AMD has been doing an amazing job at their company and I'm loving, and I'm loving what they are doing. The next one I have is Google. I shouldn't have to explain exactly what Google is to you, but I'm up 11%. $133.77. I have one share of Google. Netflix, I have three shares of Netflix. I'm actually down $71, but um, I'm a supporter of Netflix. I use, the company, I use their um, app all the time. I see Netflix doing big things in the future, especially with their original. Um, Disney, Disney, I am up $26.77, up 4.86%. Um, over the last month, Disney just announced their earnings in Disney Plus. So the last month alone, Disney went up 9%. I own four shares of Disney. Facebook, I am up 53 cents with Facebook. Uh, Facebook owns Instagram, uh, Facebook, and, and, and Facebook runs the world, okay? So I'm always gonna have at least one share of Facebook. Um, WM Waste Management, I'm up $13.99. This um, company pays out 1.79% in dividends, and I have been collecting dividends from this company on my history. I got paid twice, $1.54, and in September, I got paid $1.54. And this company has been growing over the last year consistently, up 21% over the last year. Uh, the second one uh, I own that is a utility company is Aqua America, which is water. It's just like waste management. It's up 29% over the last year. I own four shares and I'm actually down $1.70, but it pays a dividend yield of 2.06%. I own four shares of water. Ford, Ford is a high paying dividend company. Its uh, market cap is over $35 billion and it has a dividend yield of 7.84%. Um, over the last year, Ford has been a little rocky, is down 0.5%. Over the last five years, Ford is down 39%. And living in Texas, everyone knows Ford. The best selling truck in the world is the Ford F-150. Um, I see it all the time in Texas. I see this company actually bouncing back in the future. So if you could get Ford now for $8.97, you could begin it for a steal, especially with the dividends of 7.84%. Right now on four shares of Ford with an equity of $35.88. Um, the next one I have is AT&T, Tickle Simber T. I own 18 shares, $710. I am up $51.13. And this company pays a dividend of 7.04%. And I've been collecting dividends on this one for, how uh, times have they paid me out? A couple times I got paid $2 in August and $5 in this month of November. Okay, the next one I own is Coca-Cola. Um, I really shouldn't have to explain what Coca-Cola is. It's, uh, it's a nation global wide type company and they usually do good around Christmas times with their commercials. Uh, the company is up 4.69% over the last year. I'm actually down $2.62, but this company pays a dividend of 3.29% with a market cap of $225 billion. Okay, so we're going to my monthly dividend paying stocks. The first one I own is SPHD. This one pays me out monthly. 
uh, the price is at $43.28 of the last year. It's up 5.54%. I own 32 shares uh, with an equity of $1,384.96. I'm up $44.02, but it's been paying me dividends every single month. Um, in October, I got paid $4.72 worth of dividends. The next one I have is a high yield dividend company, uh, AGNC. Uh, this company is actually down 1.48%. But if you got in right there around in September, you actually would have got it for a good price because this company had a major rebound over the last three months, up 6.38%. Uh, the equity I have in this company is $1,179.80. I own 68 shares and I'm up $71.26, 6.4%. The dividend yield on this company is 12.31%. So this one has been paying me um, every single month. Um, in November, I'm going to get paid $10.56 just from owning AGNC. The next one I own is, is SPYD. It's pretty much just like SPHD. Um, I'm thinking about just combining the two. I own $509.99 worth of SPYD. Uh, $14, I'm up $14.41 and this company pays a dividend yield of 4.73%. Okay, the next one I own is Intel. Took a by INTC. Uh, the price is at $57.94. I own one share just because it's a competitor with AMD and it actually pays a dividend of 2.57%. I'm up 19% with Intel, $9.50. The next one I have is another high paying dividend stock. The last three months is up 6.8%. It's NRZ. Um, this one has a dividend yield of 14.8%. Uh, 0.7%. I'm actually down $63 on my total return, but that doesn't really show my real returns because if we scroll down to my dividend payouts, I got paid $35 out in October and $27 out in July. And when I get my next payment, I will actually be in profit from NRZ. So that is a high paying dividend stock. And I was actually up not too long ago, let's go back and look at it. Uh, yeah, it just had a little dip right here, down 1.61%. But when I was up 4%, I was actually up a lot on my profit. But this is a long-term hold for me. Uh, I see NRZ paying me big dividend yields out in the future. And as long as I make my money back on this year, I will continue to invest into this company. The next one I have is VOO, Vanguard SP500 ETF. This one is a slow grower over the last year. It's up 14%, so that's not so slow. But um, it's the Vanguard S&P 500. You pretty much invest and hold it to this one forever. It has a dividend yield of 1.93%. I have two shares with an equity of $572.54. This one I have is CTRE. Uh, the price is at $20.11. I am actually down. I'm actually down $12.15. Um, I own three shares with an equity of $60.33. And this one pays a dividend yield of 4.44%. And the last three I'm not even going to talk about on YouTube because when I talked about them, uh, YouTube actually demonetized my video just by talking about those three stocks or if it was the pictures that I showed. So if you want to know what those stock was, you can go back to my last video and take a look exactly what I was talking about, but I'm not going to talk about it in this video specifically. But yeah, guys, my account just reached $12,000. Um, YouTubers can now get an extra $500 worth of income by inviting uh, three or more friends to, to sign up for Robinhood. So if you guys want to help out this channel, hit the thumbs up button, subscribe, Comment down below what free stock uh, that you receive from me by clicking the link down in the description or what stocks do you own that uh, that we have in common with my portfolio. But yeah, guys, I'm at $12,000 on my way to $13,000. I'm thinking about doing another giveaway soon. So go ahead and subscribe so you don't miss my giveaway. But other than that, this is Zeke bringing you the Dream Green Show and I'm out. Peace.